Hello, it's August 18th and I'm at the New York Botanical Garden. Half of the sign is a little bit obscured by the beautiful plants, so looks like we're in for a promising day in ahead. All right, found the native plant garden. Let's go in, take a look, nice shaded area. definitely see a lot of dragonflies and butterflies as well. So the botanical gardens is not just for plants but for animals as well. Take a look at this though, this is all native plants. Some rocks here as well. What is this, sedimentary rock? I think I see some layers. Definitely seeing these white flowers around. It is a bright, hot, sunny day. Makes sense, it's August. <laughs> I'm sure in cooler days people would sit on these rocks. It's pretty hot right now. But we have some nice benches in case anyone wants to sit. hiding in this brush here. I just saw a chipmunk as well. We saw that salamander earlier. Kind of want to get out of here. Who knows what else is hiding in here. Just looping back around to where the water was. Okay, they say that there's a trail here. I feel like I'm gonna get just get bit by like insects and stuff if I walk through this right now because I'm not wearing post toed shoes or anything. So we will save that for another day. Looks fun though. Don't do this. This is just ridiculous and extremely rude. From here, I'm actually gonna say goodbye to the beautiful water and I'm going to head over to this path. I'm not sure where it's gonna take me, but Let's see, I believe these are all native plants as well. Oh, and you've got some ferns going on. Very nice. There's a bunch of ferns on this side. And the signs are telling me that we might be able to see chipmunks here. I saw a chipmunk earlier. I'm sure they're hiding from me now. We've alerted each other to my presence. This is a nice little viewpoint here. You get a sense of what New York really used to be like and in some parts really still is just like this. Not in New York City though, except for probably the botanical garden. This is just what the forest floor is probably like. Lots of ferns, lots of greenery, some large trees giving shade. And of course, some rocks everywhere with moss growing on them. Oh, and I've made it into a complete circle back where I started. I wish I had brought some water with me, but we're on to the next part. I also believe this is a really good time to go to the Everett Children's Garden or the Children's Adventure Garden. I will not be going here as I do not have a child with me, but this August is a good time to go in there as well. It looks so colorful and very welcoming. Is that a chipmunk? Yeah, there's a chipmunk hiding in there. Why are all these animals just like staring me down? I don't know, maybe it's scared. Let's go. I think the rock garden is up here. Yes, we can go this way. It's just very sunny though. There's no shade, so 
If the rock garden is closed, I will not be too happy. This is just another viewpoint to the native garden, which actually on the map looks small, but as you can see, it is quite large and expansive. so cute. They're literally just growing in between rocks. And I'm just like walking on rocks too. This is not the best place for open toed shoes, but here we are. Ooh, that water looks cloudy. There's something living in there or that's just like the fountain to like circulate the water probably. I don't think anything's really living in there. Right now at least. Oh, I hear some water. Like some gushing water. Let's see how these. I think this is a little creek. Oh, yeah, for sure. Oh, you know what? It hasn't rained in a while, so things are just a little bit dry right now. So this creek like goes all the way down. All right, let's just take a walk around. This area like smells really good. Okay, we have some poppies over here. They're all just like growing in the rocks, so cool. I had no idea so many plants could do this. These leaves are huge. Got a nice variety of colors, so many shades of green. Oh, this may have been the gushing water actually. What a beautiful waterfall. Take a look at this. I just want to like run up this. I'm not going to, but it just looks so fun. Imagine just running up and then just sliding down the waterfall. Okay, that would hurt actually. They're like steps through this waterfall. Oh, that's a cool tree. And I love how you can't see everything at once. You kind of have to turn around corners and such to be able to see everything. And this is that tree. Let's see what it's called. Thompson's yucca. Okay. Oh, another salamander. Is it salamander season? Do they have seasons? I don't know, but it went under that rock. Good for a salamander. It's finding some shade. It's probably cool under those rocks too. Oh, this one's just called rock beauty. Okay, so I just read a sign that tells me that there's actually cool water running, running underneath these rock formations and that's what would happen naturally if a glacier were to pass by over this. You wouldn't really see water on top, but there would actually be cold water running underneath allowing these plants to survive through the hot summers. of water and I think that's going to be it for August. Please remember to bring water, don't do what I did. Oh wait, there's actually something swimming in there. I think it's like an insect or maybe it's a salamander. But anyways, bring water if you come to the botanical gardens in the summer and have fun.